If you want to launch a 1 million meme coin on base blockchain, this video is for you. Base blockchain volume on meme coins is going crazy and is your best opportunity to make your own meme coin successful. Today, I'm going to show you how to deploy your own token and create a liquidity pool for your token and make it success. All this with a setup that will make your token go even further. Essentially, Smith Tools is a no-code tool suite where you can create and launch your project on Web3 within different blockchains, okay, in this case, Base, and it's fully audited by CoinFabric. It's important when you enter the website that you have Base selected, okay, and that you have connected your wallet. To start, we are going to use directly to Base Token Creator. This tool will allow us to create our own custom token with different settings, as you can see here and in just a few seconds okay the fees are really low the cost is only 0.01 ethereum we can also use these extra features that will make it a bit more expensive but is the cheapest method available right now in the whole base blockchain okay so to start i'm going to create a good token okay i'm gonna use um shrimp with hat and the ticker will be S W H. Then we move on with the supply. In this case, most meme coins launch with 1 billion supply. So we go with that. And important here, we can set our own tax, our own fee per transaction that we will be receiving. In this case, I'm gonna use four. Uh, I don't recommend at all using fee. It will depend on the purpose of your project. For meme coins, the less fees, the more chances to go successful. And important here, we can set the wallet that will receive the fees. By default, it will be the wallet that we are using to create the token, but we can use any other wallet we want. To finish, we have the advanced option. We have the airdrop mode, disable everyone from trading or sending our token while it's active. We also have the anti bot that prevents every bot from trading our token by blocking them to trade twice or token in the same block. We also have the anti whale, which is really important. Okay, with anti whale, we can set up all these options. We have the token limit per trade that will be the maximum amount that someone can buy or sell of a token. For example, we can use. 1 million we also have the time limit per trade in hours we can set a limit and like uh, some sort of interval that someone need to wait uh, between each transaction of buying or selling or token we will put one hour here then we have the total limit per wallet this limit is the total amount that a single wallet can hold okay so we will put uh, 10 millions for example and also we can set how much days this mode this anti whale mode or this anti whale settings will be active okay let's put for example a week so the total cost will be 0.015 ethereum plus the gas fees okay on base nothing so we are gonna click on great token and here we have the transaction okay these are the gas fees and this is the total cost okay in this transaction we are creating the token this is the token address okay we will be able to find it on basecamp once transaction is completed and then we need to sign another transaction to confirm and enable the anti will mode we have selected here we have the second transaction and this is perfect we can copy the address of the token and paste it on basecan and we will find our token address verify and this is the contract this is the total supply, this is the name, the ticker, and everything is as stated. Something really important is that the contract is already verified. Okay, here you can see the short contract. As I said, it's fully audited, so you don't need to worry about it. But it's important that our token is directly verified here in Basecamp. So we can come here and click on update token info and add our logo, add some social links, etc., which is really important when launching your token. You just need to click on update token info, login, here you register yourself and fill in the information and it will be updated as soon as they approve those, those changes. So also important the account that you need to connect here with the wallet you are using in here for creating the token, okay? So they can identify yourself. Perfect. Now we have our token created and the anti-whale. 
Take on account that if you want to use any of the settings we have before or enable them later, here you have the token manager and you can do everything. Okay, you can manage the token settings. Here you can select the token, stream we've had, and here we can set a new address to receive tax, exempt address from the tax, blacklist address, honor token. If we have the airdrop mode activated, we will be able to deactivate it here. Also, we have the manage antibot. Here we can enable or disable antibot. Here we have, we can enable it. And we have the manage anti whale where we can modify or update or anti whale settings. Okay, here you can modify everything and update it with it. <clears throat> so now that we have our token ready, we need to launch the liquidity pool to allow people to trade it. Smithy also provides its own tool to create the liquidity pool. It's pretty cheap, almost nothing, and it's really cool because it will take some advantages, give us some advantages that will help us. Okay. In here, uh, our liquidity pool will be created on Uniswap, which is the best exchange right now on base blockchain. And also our token will be listed directly on places like Dex Tools, uh, Dex Screener, etc., which is pretty important as well. So for creating a liquidity pool, we just need to select the base token. The base token will be the token we have created. Okay, in this case, a shrimp we've had. Then we will select the quote token. The quote token is the token with a value in the market. In this case, the most useful to use is Ethereum. And we have 0.01 wrap Ethereum that we will be adding to the liquidity pool. And here we can select how much stream we've had, how much of our token we want to add to the liquidity pool. I will recommend you to add at least from 80 to 95% of the liquidity pool. We will add everything as this is a tutorial. Now we have everything ready. We just need to click on create liquidity pool and we will need to sign different transactions. The first one is to approve the use of our tokens. Perfect. Here we have the second one. So here we approve it. Perfect. And then we finish with the LP creation that will be the last transaction. Once it's ready, we just need to come to Basecan, copy your token address. We can add it to MetaMask as well, okay? It won't appear by default, as you can see, but you can import it by entering your token address. Here you can see it, perfect. And we can import it. So now we can see it here. And once we have created our liquidity pool, we can come here and look for our token. Here we have a stream we've had and we will be able to trade it here without any problem. As you can see, creating your own meme going on base blockchain is not that difficult. Now that you know how to do it without coding and in an easy way, you need to focus on the most important. The meme should be a good one and you should push the marketing as much as possible to make it trend, to make it pump and go to the moon. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one. Bye bye.